I guess I'll start with a little bit about me. I've always been passionate about art, but never found the means to acquire of anything of note until the last few years. The first piece I bought from Damien Hirst was a roll of his butterfly wallpaper, which I had cut and framed. At the time, I thought this would be the closest I would get to owning something from him directly. I've always been fascinated by Hirst's work, as it seemed to pull the viewer into the art itself by involving us in the narrative. His work seemed to be like Marmite. You either loved it or hated it. And yet I found those who hated it seemed to get some enjoyment out of this aversion. I can't be professed to be a fan of everything, for one. Um, I'm not a lover of the portrayals of death, as I find these a bit gory for my liking. But for me, it's the immersive aspect of his work that really fascinates me. Whether it's the wreck of the unbelievable, where the film and the narrative pull the viewer into the story, or the use of live and dead flies, where the viewer's reaction seems to be part and parcel of the piece. It would seem that with his NFT, yet again, Hearst has managed to capture our attention and pull us into the art. To begin with, I've not seen a Discord community as positive and active as the one uh, we have here. And that's a true credit and testimony to the amazing team, moderators and support from Henny. But the questions and discussions about what is art, what makes projects success, project successful, what is more valuable, digital or physical, and whether money and gains are an important aspect of the space, are constant and evolving in a fundamental aspect of this project. We, the holders, the community, have become part of the art, and our discussions and decisions have helped drive the direction and the organic growth of this project. For me to be able to participate in an Hearst project is, is a dream, but I realise that I'm no longer a holder of Hearst's work, but I feel that I represent one of the many dots within the art itself.